Hey guys, this is Jason. Okay, I don't have a cool intro for videos yet, so you're gonna have to bear with me until I come up with one or find somebody who knows more than I do. With that being said, I wanted to introduce you to my new car. Got it about a month and a half ago, and I'm gonna take you guys on a journey of building it. And I know a lot of people have a lot of friends that have high horsepower builds, but uh, having 20, 30, 40 grand to sink into a car is just not, uh, feasible to some people, me being one of them. So I want to kind of take you guys on this journey and have you see what I'm going to go through to make this a reliable daily driver that you can take onto the track and hopefully dominate my goal for this and we're going to have some fun. So let me show you what I got here. So first things first, we got a Subaru STI. Let me angle the camera a little bit. We got a Subaru STI, it is a 2004. It's not the prettiest, but it is definitely not that bad at all. You can see, I uh, haven't really done anything since I got it in the last two months I've been prepping. We do have some paint chips right here, some uh, nicks and dings, but overall, it's a pretty good car. So we still have the GoPro mount on. Um, the biggest thing that I want to look at getting fixed uh, is these rims. If you see, uh, they used to be pink. You can kind of see down in the back here. Um, well, the people who I bought it from, which you'll learn more about later, uh, thought it'd be a good idea to take off all the pink. Thought it'd sell better. I definitely want to get either new ones of these or I want to get some paint and repaint them. Uh, definitely some dinged up parts on the front bumper. This is fading. Got some more chips here. Um, yesterday, like I said, we did go to the Ridge uh, Motorsports Park. They were absolutely phenomenal. Uh, what was that Tuesday? So Monday I took this into my detailer and we got that all cleaned up. If you even see the headlights look fantastic. Now they're really bright. We do have some bugs on there, but you know, that's what happens when you drive, you know, three, 400 miles in a single day. The worst of the rims is the front driver's side. And as I was telling you, they were pink. You can still see some pink down there. Um, the problem is when they went to clean them, they thought it'd be a really good idea to take off the pink plastic dip with airplane cleaner. And that really screwed up the Brembos along with the road, along with the rims. So you can see the gold is coming off, not looking good at all. Um, so yeah, that's going to be one of the things visually I want to get fixed. Uh, but overall it's good. After the detail, you know, it really brings out some of the places that have problems. But overall, this is a absolutely beautiful car. Um, the other big markup is on the back wing here. I don't know if you guys can tell, but we definitely have some uh, oxidization or whatnot on here. I don't know what that's called. I'm not really a body man, but you can tell there used to be a stripe here. And that stripe was actually pink. And it went all the way up the car, but luckily along here is absolutely beautiful. There's no problems on here, no problems on the hood. But yeah, we will talk a lot more since I've got it. The only things that I've pretty much done to it are a nameless uh, front delete and the nameless sticker up top. Nameless is going to be a big part of bringing this car to life. So on our journey, if you guys have any questions, feel free to ask. Feel free to message me. Uh, you can tell. Went to the track yesterday and it did get a little bit used. We're gonna need some new tires. But that's my journey, guys. I hope you come along with me and we're gonna have some fun. I don't know uh, what all we're gonna do this exactly, but over the next uh, three months, we are gonna build this. In 2017, we are gonna hit probably about uh, eight, to 10 track days and about 20 different car events uh, all over the Northwest. 
Um, yeah, I don't know. I'm excited. Hope you guys are too. And please remember to hit the subscribe and or the like button.